Today I'm going to review one of the top EIs on the MQL5 marketplace and I'm going to squeeze all of the information so we can see if it is worthwhile the money. It is called the EA Gold Stuff MT5 and the price sits at 100 $49 and for your reference it was $50 about 8-9 months ago so the price is already triple and it's quite interesting for me as well to see why they increase the price and if it is really worthwhile $150. One thing I have noticed is that this EA stays on the first page on MQL5 which is huge for every EA developer but the second thing is if you look at the logo it is the only one that is not a full square as a colorful image it is a star with white background which makes it just stand out from the rest and secondly the star simply talks about review and rating and if I click on it you will see that this EA has over 500 reviews which is a lot for the MQL5 marketplace. I will click on those and you will see that there are plenty. I know many of you comment below my videos that most of the reviews are from robots or from the developer himself. I truly believe this is a common practice so I cannot really say how many of these 560 reviews are real but as well there are over 1200 comments which might be very useful if you go through all of them. I know it will take time so I will leave that on you. Now if we look at the overview we will see that it was updated in March this year and then down below in the settings we can see some more information about inputs. We have some real results here, I will click on that and no, I was redirected to all of the experts from the seller so probably I will have to do it again so I will click on real-time results can be viewed here and again I was actually redirected to all of the seller's products no comment on that we have some screenshots showing a fantastic backtest with some huge drawdowns this talks to me that probably there is some kind of grid or martingale system behind i will scroll through the pictures quickly that's quite an interesting and active ea and i will do the back test myself in a second what i want to show you is that we have settings and manual so i will be downloading the settings for the ea gold stuff for mt5 here it is and once i open it you can see that there are set files not only for gold but as well for dollar cat new zealand pound dollar pound swiss pound aussie euro dollar and aussie dollar so it looks like a gold robot that trades on forex pairs interesting so just copy the two digit gold m15 set and i will open the vps where i have a few live accounts right in here i'm testing the king robot on a demo account i reviewed that robot some time ago and actually so far it brings profits then i have on my other account the funded ftmo with the waka waka and i just paused the trading there because today is the split day so i have to close all trades by the end of the day and decide if i want to withdraw or keep the profits for the next month this is how ftmo funded account works i have the darwin x life account where i'm trading the night hunter pro which shows only profits until the moment that's really cool here are all trades i had and then i have the black bull markets life account where i'm trading the golden pickaxe with very very low risk settings on 500 dollars life account because i'm planning to trade this robot on much bigger account so i I want to test really how this robot performs on the very low settings and actually I'm planning to record a video very soon with all of my accounts how I 
I'm managing, where I'm keeping them, what robots I use currently in my live accounts. So it is already in my to-do list. And now here I will go to the market, I will click on experts and I will go to the EA Gold Stuff MT5, I will download the demo and it should be added on my experts tab, here it is. And now I will just open one more chart for gold and I will switch to M15 and I will drag and drop the expert advisor so we can see all of the inputs. And before I perform a back test, uh, let me tell you about the VPS because many of you as well asked me which VPS I'm using. Currently I'm using Forex VPS. I'll leave a link down below in the description for the website and for the very beginners VPS is simply a virtual machine, virtual computer where I install just MetaTrader platforms with different EAs, especially those that are on live accounts because if you want to have constant connection with the server of your broker, you need to keep your PC or laptop switched on all the time. If you close your laptop, if you turn off your computer, this will disconnect the MetaTrader from the server and the EAs will stop working. So it's not from the EAs. This is how MetaTrader works and you need to be connected to the internet. So right in here I have the VPS and right in here I have on this monitor the MetaTrader platforms that are on my machine in the studio. So if I show you this platform on the screen, you can see that it is connected to the server and usually I am not stopping my computer here at any moment. It works 24 seven. I have plenty of MetaTraders installed, but it's not enough. I have a few VPSs and I have a few more machines, but that's my job. I do that daily and you really don't need to, but if you're incapable of keeping your PC on all the time, then a VPS is a good solution. What is interesting with this expert advisor is the fact that you can control the risk and that is a very common money management where you can decide with how much lots you want to trade according to the account you have. For example, with the default, we have 0 0.01 for every thousand dollars. In other words, when your account grows, you can decide to start opening trades with bigger amount. Then below we have the lot multiplier. We have the option to decide what should be the maximum lot. So yep, there is some kind of grid or martingale system that we will see in the back test. What else we have? Take profit and we don't have a stop loss. We have the option to trail the start and to trail the step, which I'm not really 100% sure what exactly is meant by those inputs, but what I will do, I will load the settings I just downloaded for the M15 and I will open those. So this is a ready set file that you can load and it is kind of recommendation from the developer for that asset and time frame. What I see now is that the lot multiplier increased to 1.55, the entry amount is the same, max lot is 100. This is huge. I'm afraid that's a little bit too risky if the market goes against us, but let's leave it the way he suggested. Then the take profit is 200. I guess this is in points, not in pips, but I guess we will see that in the back test. And then if I scroll lower, you will see that we have some options for start hour and end hour. Then we have a drawdown reduction algorithm and you can check all of the inputs yourself once you download uh, the EA on MetaTrader. But now let's test it and see the real thing. I'll just close it and I will go to the EA right click and I will select test. The strategy tester will open below and I have the option to select the symbol. So I'm going for gold on M15 chart because this was the set file. So I guess that's the recommended time frame. I will test first for the last one year. I will select every tick 
and I will run it with a visual mode so we can understand more about the EA, how the strategy behind works because this is very important for me. And you can see that we have quite an active trading. I will increase the speed a little bit to see some good examples. But what I see is that whenever we have long signals, the EA will add to the position and whenever we have short signals or it sells but the price goes up, the EA will add again to the position. And let me just decrease now the speed actually, I will pause it and I will show you this example over here, you can see that we had a long trade in here, then the price went down, another long trade on the next candlestick, and then another long trade at the next candlestick, or all in total we have five candlesticks where long trades were opened, and then you can see in this moment we have short trade, the price goes up and it was short trade again and the second one was closed in here so that's not really a good example to see or understand how the EA works. Right in here we have those short trades and you can see that they were closed in here and there was a long trade so it was kind of a reverse signal to close all short trades and open the long ones. But one more time if I go to the end what we can notice is that the EA opened short trades so you can see that currently there are plenty of short trades starting with 0 0.1, 0 0.15, 0 0.23, 0 0.34, 0.57. So the EA increases the lot and the price goes up and at one moment when these losses are recovered, I guess it will hit the take profit. Let's see what will happen. I will increase the speed a little bit. You see the price goes just sideways and here it is, they were closed. Okay, so once the price goes against us, the EA will add to the position with higher lot which obviously brings this EA to the risky category and then it might trade in both directions. I saw that in times there were long and short trades. There is break even for the buy or for the sell. And if I just show you the open trades, you can see that nearly all the time we are handling negative open trades. So I can define this EA like a scalping strategy that uses some kind of grid or martingale system to recover the losses. So every time there are open trades, you will be handling losses, which is not really likable for many traders. I will close now the visual mode because I don't think we will be able to understand anything more and I will just perform the test so we can see the graph which is pretty much the equity and the balance line. And here we go, so the blue line is the balance or these are the close results, the close trades and the green one is the equity and yes as i told you whenever the price goes against us we will be handling those negative results in the open trades and you can see that at that point we had a drawdown from 10,050 down to what is it Okay, that's not a huge drawdown. There is even a bigger one. It dropped below 8,000, which is more than 20%. And you can see that this drawdown was from the beginning of 2023 until the 5th of January. Okay, so for five days, the EA succeeded to recover this loss. But now I don't wanna make the video too long. I will leave it running and we will see the back test. And while I'm waiting for the back test to complete, let me tell you about the broker that I'm using for algorithmic trading the most. And this is Black Bull Markets, a fully regulated broker based in New Zealand. They offer a few different account types. I use the most the standard because there is no commission. Of course, if you have bigger capital, you can have a look at the ECN Prime or the ECN Institutional. What I like the most 
with Black Bull Markets is that they offer plenty of platforms, TradingView, MetaTrader 5 and MetaTrader 4. As an algorithmic trader, I use the most MT4 and MT5, but with one control panel, I have access to all of my accounts. I can easily transfer funds between one account in MetaTrader 4 to another account that is with MetaTrader 5. Recently, I funded my account with crypto, which is good enough for me. And most importantly, the spread stays to normal whenever we have very volatile market, just like at the moment I'm recording this video. Look at the price of gold. And as well, if I show you Euro dollar, you would notice a very impulsive move because right now we had the core CPI in the US and the Euro dollar spread and with the rest stayed between one and two pips, which is very, very good spread in such volatile market. As well, let me show you the gold spread while there is again very volatile move in gold because of these hot economic news. So if I keep trading with the EAs during the news, which I usually do, I'm not afraid that there will be huge spread or slippage pretty good market conditions from the black bull market so I'll leave a link down below in the description so you can guys check them out on a demo or live account and now let's see what the outcome will be from the back test and surprisingly the account was blown you can see how surprised I am in March this year you can see that the equity went down, the EA couldn't really recover. And if I show you the back test, we see total net profit negative 5,300 when we started with 10,000. And if I go back to the graph one more time, you can see that there were those huge drawdowns a few times. There was one really big in here. So at that point, the account was sitting at about 15,000 or even higher and it dropped down to 10,000. So it was like $5,000 of a drawdown, like 30%. And then a little bit later in March, it was completely blown. And I'm not surprised the EA has blown the account. What I'm really surprised about is that I used the set files provided by the developer in July. 2023 so these files actually blow the account and he still provides those this is so unbelievable and actually if you look at the landing page again you will see that there were over 20,000 downloads of the free version just as I did so 20,000 people back tested this EA and check this out there were five activations only and as well if i go to the reviews and i filter them by negative you will see that there are plenty of negative one star reviews i won't go through them you can do that yourself but there are obviously not happy people because this ea is super risky and it can blow your account or probably i should say it will blow your account if you don't decrease the risk drastically and we saw in the inputs that there is the option to decrease the risk like i can increase the amount for 0.01 and i can decrease the loss multiplier to point 0.1 but there comes the dilemma if it is really worthwhile trading it because if we go with a very very low risk then we will make very small profits but if you are planning to use DCA, I would strongly recommend that you lower the risk as maximum as possible. You can contact the developer, I guess, and he will tell you what are the set files with a very low risk settings. At least I hope he will share that with you. So you won't blow your account. But even with the very low risk settings, from what I see as comments, as backtest with the set files that he actually provided, I'm very skeptical that even with the low risk settings, the account is protected from disaster. 
Now I'll leave it on you to do your due diligence. I remain very skeptical with this EA and with most of the EAs that I review. And I will keep recording videos about expert advisors, reviewing them and trying to protect you from the scam EAs and developers. And if you have experience with this EA or any other and you think it is a scam, just let us know down in the comments. If I see a small signal of a scam, I will let you know. Thank you guys so much for staying with me until the end of the video. Check out this video on my side for another EA that I'm already trading on my live account. And if you have any questions, I'm a message away. Thanks for watching and being my subscriber. Have a wonderful day, trade safe and don't forget that I love you.